Hi Nokia fans, Nokia Maps version 2.5 just came out. In this video, we are going to take a look at route planning, which is one of the new features in this version. Take a look. In the new version of Nokia Maps 2.5, you can now set your destination and your starting point. So here, for example, I'm gonna go ahead and go search for uh, Mid Valley. That's uh, one of the largest malls here in KL. So I'll do that. If I click on get directions in the previous version, it will automatically use your current location and, and show, you, show your route. In the new version, you could go ahead and change the from and change that to something else. So for example, tomorrow we will be in a different location from now. And uh, so I'll go select park view as the starting point and now I know how to get to Mid Valley from that new location instead of my current location. Uh, once that is set, you have three options here. You could go by foot, by public transportation, or by car. The public transportation really surprises me because it works here in Malaysia. So you could see it will tell me which bus to take and which uh, stop to get off. So that's very cool. If I go walk, it will tell me how long it will take. So you could see here it's an hour and 42 minutes, uh, definitely not an option for me. Or here you could take the car, 16 minutes or eight kilometers. Nokia also announced that you are able to pin your routes to the home screen, but as you could see here at the bottom, that option is grayed out. It's not available for me. Version 2.5 for Nokia Maps is a great update, but there are a few more things that are still missing. For example, it would be nice to have multiple points instead of just uh, two points, a starting and a destination. It would be nice to add, I guess, three or four points to add on the route. Also, it would be nice to use my favorite places when choosing from and uh, destination points. For example, if I click from, it will show my search history and uh, the search bar instead of uh, my favorite places. So in the next version, Nokia Maps, if you're listening to me, Please have an option here at the bottom that will uh, let me select those favorite places that I've saved here on Nokia Maps. All right, that's route planning for Nokia Maps version 2.5. I hope this video was helpful to you. If you like watching this video, please click on the like button. It helps me out and lets me know that these kind of videos are helpful to you. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel to watch my videos before they get published on the blog. That's it for now. I'm Mark Wim. Thanks for watching. Start talking? Are we good? Yeah, do the test run.